John has come into this series having had his heart broken, losing losing the woman he finally thought he could connect with, and uh, he's gone back to being a, a loner and just focusing on the job. But um, he's having to deal with all sorts of uh, potentially supernatural, scary stuff going on, which he doesn't believe in. So um, it's a whole new realm he's entering into, really. But uh, lots, lots more horror and nasty, nasty murders, and he's desperately trying to bring somebody in alive. Well, it's lovely to play somebody who has so many sort of different foibles and tics, so I can uh, express how he's feeling through through neat, neatening things up and through putting on my tiger balm and through straightening my clothes. And to have somebody who gets himself into such an uptight state but never actually loses his temper is always fun and a struggle to play, but fun. And uh, really the relationship between him and Miles, I think, is probably the most enjoyable. Really. I don't know if I should answer that really. Uh, he, he does catch killers, but whether they stay alive or not, you'll have to wait and see. <laughs>